Hello, ladies and gentlemen, this is the bomb, 6969696969. Many of you guys know me from Black Ops. I am the best COD player in the world. Uh, challenge me. I'm always up for challenges. Um, this in regards to Dead Island, the corrupted data um, glitch, where people try loading their games and it's corrupted. Um, I probably put about 300 hours into this game, and I'm 90% sure now that the reason why it keeps corrupting is because you have too much stuff on GIF. Um, I used to think that in the beginning, and then I started going towards the uh, only multiplayer games, but uh, then it happened to be a single player, so the only possibility is that you have too much stuff on Jint. Um, I have about a little under 70 items on one of my level 50 accounts, and it hasn't corrupted yet. Uh, uh, thank God I got PlayStation Plus now. I've probably corrupted about 60 times, 55 to 60 times on all my accounts. It's pretty pathetic. Um, yeah, but that's pretty much all I got to say about that. Um, in a related matter, Dead Island, uh, um, Deep Silver, you guys are absolutely pathetic, man. That's that's terrible that you guys fucking made a game without without doing any quality control. That's absolutely ridiculous. Um, I'm a 22 year old dude that figured out the problem with your game, and that's your jobs. I mean, you guys are. I'm never buying another game from Deep Silver ever again. Just to tell you. It's absolutely ridiculous. You guys have... You know, how long has this game been trying to get out for, like, like years and years now, and you guys finally brought it out, and it's shit? My God. I mean, the gameplay is amazing, yeah, but there's so many glitches, it's not even funny. I mean, there's no reason why it should have that many glitches. I'm sorry, but, uh... Yeah, you, you lost the customer for me, that's for sure. This game is amazing, though. I will say that it's one of the best MMOs. Um, well, if you can consider it an MMO kind of like, yeah, kind of like an animal. Um, yeah, you guys are shit. Uh, have a good day.